But the second impossibility is, is that then you've got to walk out of here and change your life. You've got to walk out of here and follow Christ. You've got to walk out of here and be the kind of man that God wants you to be. You've got to walk out of here and be the student that God is dreaming that you're going to be. You've got to walk out of here and read this Bible and say, hey, this is going to be my map, my, my guide. This is what I want to be about. And when you start getting into that journey, you're going to realize it's the second impossibility. I can't become everything God wants me to be. I can't go and sin no more. Is there anybody here that got the first part of grace and you knew your sins were forgiven, but when you walked to go and sin no more, you realized you didn't have the power to do that thank you one and guess what our story is grace (laughs) it's God at work to put people back together with him in the first place and to empower them through his life to live the life that only he can live It's the one and only grace. And it just funnels back to our three anchors. Because if Christ is the one who reconciles me to God, who else am I going to make famous with my life? 